It's the first boat to the USS Arizona Memorial since Oahu's popular visitor attraction was closed for repairs 15 months ago. Thousands of tourists and residents visited the monument today to honor and pay their respects to those who served and suffered during the attack on Pearl Harbor more than 77 years ago. Among them were Bob and Patty Drake of Minneapolis, who waited in line nearly two hours this morning. This is a, uh, a bucket list thing. Pretty impressive, it really was. Uh, nothing short of incredible. I had tears running through my face. I, I couldn't help it. It's very sad. The memorial has been closed since May 2018, after the dock was partially submerged and cracks were found. More than $2 million was spent on the renovation project. We had to do the, rebuild the system from scratch and do it safely so people can now access it. I think we're all frustrated with the amount of time it took uh, to complete these, uh, these repairs, uh, but uh, having listened a little bit more closely to the technical challenges, I understand uh, that they needed to have the time to do this right, and I think they did do it right. The economic impact of the 15-month shutdown of the USS Arizona was not only harsh on the park itself, but also on the businesses that rely on it. Visitor traffic to the park is down about 30 percent. The drop in attendance has also affected sales at the Memorial's bookstore, as well as the business of tour operators that bring visitors to the site. All on. One unexpected benefit, tours to the nearby USS Missouri have increased during the Arizona's closure. Attendance throughout the monument is expected to surge back now that the fixes are complete. I'm totally blessed that it was open. We just came to visit Hawaii for the first time and um, happens to be that it was open this um, Sunday that we're here, so it's such a blessing. Rick Desog, Hawaii News Now.